It looks like Cara Delevingne is supporting Rihanna's upcoming fashion show, Savage X Fenty Volume 4. Cara walked down the stage, and you know who else was in it? Johnny Depp, of course. That's something that wasn't on her 2022 bingo card. Not only did Johnny bag another job after winning the defamation trial against his ex-wife, he also got her ex to support him this time. Is the supermodel and the actor finally teaming up? And what happens to Amber Heard now? Cara has been making headlines recently, but they weren't what you'd expect them to be. None of them were that positive. Not until the news broke that she started to do modeling gigs again, and with that, she's showing immense support for the Savage X Fenty fashion show. This is a big deal because as you know, Johnny Depp recently made a cameo during Rihanna's fashion show and it literally took our breath away. He may have only had 40 seconds during that show, but we're not gonna lie, we thought he was the star of the night. Well, he actually was the star of the night. According to the media, Johnny was cast as the first man to headline the star moment in the fourth installment of the Savage X Fenty annual fashion film, and this became the talk of the town. So many of his fans were so psyched for this because finally there's a gig for him after being left jobless by Hollywood. When the day came, Johnny walked to Outcast so fresh, so clean. He wears what looks to be a silk robe and his facial hair is styled so fans of the Pirate of the Caribbean franchise can easily recognize him. And then he ends up hugging a tree while wearing Savage X Fenty from head to toe. For sure there were so many people we decided to hate on the show because he was there, even though it was already proven that he's innocent of all those nasty accusations thrown at him. What these people don't know is that they're just feeding into Rihanna and Johnny's work. Ever since Rihanna hinted at Johnny's cameo, Amber Heard's fans and a few ignorant activists have engaged in a raging online dispute over who's the victim and who's the perpetrator of abuse in the marriage. So much so that Depp vs. Heard related hashtags trend every week, despite the trial ending months ago. But even with this, Johnny Depp remains unbothered because the more they talk about, the more publicity Fenty gets. They're just making more money with all this attention. At the same time, the supposed Amber Heard supporter is keeping quiet and is actively supporting Rihanna and Johnny. Cara Delevingne and Amber Heard reportedly dated right after the actor divorced Johnny Depp. Sources say that her friendship with Cara was the beginning of the end of her marriage with Johnny because it really started to drive him insane. Today, Amber is suspected to have cheated on Johnny with a lot of partners during their marriage, Cara being one of them. They were even rumored to be dating Elon Musk at the same time. Amber and Cara were spotted together so many times, even on camera. It's like they weren't even hiding that they were already together, even if Amber was still married to Johnny. Josh Drew, one of Amber's old friends, even admitted in his deposition that Amber had a three-way affair with Cara Delevingne and Elon Musk while still being married to Johnny Depp. Did Rocky tell you that Amber Heard was having an affair with Cara Delevingne while she was still married to Johnny Depp? Yes. Why is this important, you ask? Cara modeled for Fenty at the same time Johnny Depp became an honorary part of it. This is big because we thought Cara would back out of it after finding out that her ex's alleged abuse of ex is part of the show. If he was violent, wouldn't Cara boycott the show along with the rest of Team Amber? We expected her to stand for Amber Heard because of the relationship in the past. There is even an elevator footage of them making out. There it is, all right. And there it was. And there it continues. And it continues. In fact, instead of hating on the show and on Brianna, Cara probably loved the attention because was even praised to be part of this. Plus, we knew how Cara, along with Kristen Stewart and Margot Robbie, were in Amber's friend group. You know, the one that parties a lot, isn't part of Team Amber nowadays. We thought they were so close that they would defend each other. But we have a feeling that Amber is no longer part of that group after what happened during that defamation trial. We saw this especially when Cara Delevingne herself was going through a crisis and the entire thing was shared by the paparazzi. Marco Robbie and everyone from the friend group would go in and out of Cara's house, but there were zero photos of Amber Heard. It's because of that, that's why it's believed that she's not part of the group anymore. We guess they found out her true colors and are signing up with the opposite team these days. 
Isn't it fascinating that someone was in a relationship with Amber shares the stage with Johnny Depp? It definitely shows a powerful message of how she was as a partner. Honestly, we can't say we didn't have a feeling that this would happen because their friend group literally refused to testify for their good old friend Amber. Kara and Johnny's fans had a lot to say about this. One mentioned, you know she's a monster when even women in her life side with the guy. While another brought up Kara's personal struggles and added, on a side note, Kara having her name attached to Amber has ruined her. She needed to make a statement to stand apart from her and start trying to fix her image. Her personal struggle lately has been hard to watch. I hope she adds an actual statement as well as truly clarify her stance though. You just can't win once you're connected to someone like her. On the other hand, Rihanna received all that hate and she received it with open arms. She and Johnny experienced the same thing as she was literally in the same situation as him years back. She also had that type of partner. So seeing that she's supporting Johnny now when no one else wants to hire him is massive. People took to social media to share their dismay with Rihanna and her brand. They didn't shy away from cursing at the artist for hiring someone like Johnny Depp in her show. Online, anti-Depp activists expressed their disapproval using the hashtag Ditch Depp. Music producer Drew Dixon described the decision to cast the actor as really disappointing, while British singer and actor Ollie Alexander, who has previously collaborated with Savage X Fenty on a social media campaign, announced on social media that he won't be wearing the brand any longer. This sparked an online outrage and calls to boycott the singer's lingerie brand. This was also talked about badly by so many news outlets. They're even calling it weird. What's weird about two DD survivors helping each other out? Honestly, their curses and hate mean nothing after seeing the effect of Johnny Depp on Savage X Fenty. Aside from Amber Heard's exes and friends supporting him, the ratings of the show were through the roof. It's said that his appearance eclipsed the entire event, even if it was just for 40 seconds, and he even ended up hugging a tree. Johnny's segment was so good that everyone was talking about this, so much that you had to queue up for their website just to look at all the items they were selling at Fenty. Having Johnny there was every advertiser's dream. So maybe that's the reason why supermodel Cara Delevingne ended up a fan of Johnny Depp. This isn't the first time someone from Team Amber jumped ships and started supporting Johnny. Actually, because of this very bomb fashion show, the Washington Post started writing about the actor again. If you think they sound familiar, well, it's because they're one of Amber's co-conspirators who would attack Johnny Depp through writing. They were the ones who released the nightmare of an op-ed after all. We'll probably see more of this news whether we like it or not, because it really had that good of a viewership. And hey, it's also free publicity for Amber Heard. That's all for now. Thanks so much for watching.